Aries, hi, welcome to my channel. So today we've got a second half of January 2021 reading for you. No particular subject will take an issue, something you're aware of, something you're not aware of, recent past, immediate future and potential outcome. We'll clarify and get a message out there. It's not going to resonate for every single Aryan, so do check out your other placements, your moon, rising, Venus, any stellar you may have in your chat. Um, thank you for the likes, shares, subscribes, comments, everything um, continues to grow for the channel. It's much appreciated. If you haven't done so, please do. And if you want to um, book a private reading, check out the description box for all the details are in there. Okay. Aries. What's coming up to more? Ooh, the Nine of Pentacles. Financial independence. Just feeling good about yourself as well. Yeah, taking care of you. Lovely. Something you're aware of. Something you're not aware of. Recent past. Immediate future. And potential outcome. Wow. Okay, Ten of Wands. Knight of Pentacles. The Five of Wands and the Seven of Cups. There might be a lot of burdens, a lot of drama at work at the moment. I could be talking to somebody that's um, surrounded by drama at work in the sense of um, possible redundancies being discussed. Um, but I kind of feel like you're going to be fine. Uh, especially looking at the cards. I mean, there's a combination here which uh, I'm very excited for you about. So, Nine of Pentacles. You know, financial independence. Uh, just feeling good about yourself. What you're aware of is the chariot, so you could be moving. Um, but I kind of feel like this is you. You've kind of gone through major changes. I think you're starting to feel really good about yourself, and now you, you've got that drive to move forward again. What you're not aware of is the page of cups. There's possibly um, an offer of love coming in. Not necessarily. It could just be. Um, I don't know what I'm getting with that. New passion, new hobby. It could be something pretty amazing. I'm, I'm, I'm like really concentrating on the magical aspect of the fight. You know, the feet are hanging in the air and bearing in mind what's coming in and where it's next to. There could be some sort of. Um, uh, a speechless sort of uh, thing coming. Recent past is the death card. So you've gone through your changes. You've gone through transformations. Um, strong Scorpio and um, Cancer energy so far. But the immediate future is the Ace of Pentacles. The Nine of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles together is like, you know, full on super wealth. Um, so it's an exciting combination, especially because the outcome is the star. It's a wish fulfillment. Something you've dreamed of. So this page of cups could be an opportunity, an offer, an offer to in line with your what your heart wants. I'm looking at the lines coming out of the heart here. Something that your heart really desires, an opportunity possibly within business. Um, either way, it's going to be financially very, very, very beneficial. Something that's a wish fulfillment, so incredible, really. Two of Wands jump in, so it, it, this position might put you in a, at a crossroads. It might be a decision that you need to make. And I kind of want to tell you, if you've got a decision to make and it kind of appears selfish, you need to do it. Um, you know, think of you for a change, kind of is the answer there, the message there. Not feeling right at the moment, too much. Well. 
Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. Oh my god. The star wish fulfillment. You, you're healing past hurts. Tired of waiting. Um, balancing your emotions. Aries, this is incredible financially. Okay. The Nine of Pentacles with the King of Pentacles. That's awesome. That's just financial stability all around. Um, now that you're feeling good about yourself, you might be attracting a King, a king of Pentacles energy. Uh, somebody that's very, very, very abundant. Uh, what you're aware of is the Chariot with the Knight of Pentacles. So there's possibly a change of career uh, that's going to be coming quickly. Um, there's definitely some sort of offer somewhere, whether it's offer of stability from somebody or change of career, which is going to be exceptionally beneficial for you uh, financially. What you're not aware of is the Page of Cups with the Six of Cups. <laughs> okay, for some of you, this is a child star. Interesting. Uh, for others of you, this is um, possibly reaching out from somebody from your past. It doesn't have to be anything to do with love. It could be somebody from like your school days. But some, some of you, it is, it is a past lover that's coming back, offering something very, very stable. But there's somebody out there where the child is going to be a star. I'm hearing child, child star. Essentially, we've got the star here twice. Bottom of the deck and the outcome. Recent past is the death... Uh, and the four of wands so kind of an end of an investment and with the chariot here you may have moved house ended an investment within a home um, and for some of you as well and I'm quite glad about this because um, I actually explained this earlier in a private read um, you're ending the concept of twin flame uh, and I, I apologise first hand because I've used the Twin Flame concept uh, many times. Um, but the more I think about it, the more I read. It, it exists, there's no doubt about it. Um, however, I kind of feel like everybody talking about it, especially a lot of tarot readers talking about it, it's kind of giving ammunition to narcissistic people, I feel. Uh, so you'll. You'll hear me from now on say like energetic counterparts or something to, you know, to that effect. I'm really trying to pull away from that sort of dynamic and I kind of feel like you are here as well, which is fantastic. Good. The immediate future is the Ace of Pentacles with the Ace of Pentacles. There's some opportunity that's going to bring exceptional wealth for you, Aries. This is incredible read. The rest of January, keep your eye out for opportunities. Uh, especially if your kids are involved somehow, um, for some of you. Um, but there's going to be opportunities that you really need to, you know, it's once in a lifetime opportunities that you need, really need to grasp because the outcome is the star with the Ten of Pentacles. What an incredible read, um, Aries. You, you're going to have it all. Everything, everything you dreamed of. Financial stability, commitment, the house, the home, the white picket fence. Um, love if you accept it, you don't see it coming, it's in your subconscious. Um, wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I can't say anything else to be honest. Okay, you could be dealing with a strong, very strong Aquarius energy. We have Cancer energy, Scorpio energy, very heavy Pentacle energy, so uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Uh, but there's Cups, there's Wands. And the swords we have healed the past which is good so there you go aries fantastic and um, keep an eye out for these opportunities and and grab them with both hands because it's going to be um, very very beneficial okay let me know if it resonates um thank you for watching the, uh, following the channel and i'll see you soon bye